This video is going to be a detailed comparison regarding one of the industry's famous hosting company, Hostinger, plus uh, uh, one of the industry's old uh, companies, including GoDaddy. I will do a step by step comparison. Plus, uh, there is a special discount link included for Hostinger. In case if you need it, you can buy through the description of this video to get this amazing discount uh, with two of the finest open codes. Now, if you are going to see the difference, uh, let me do the comparison uh, to see around what's the difference between those. Okay, net, now let's get started with the Hostinger. Hostinger is primary web hosting company if you see around they provide you with free domains with majority of their plans if you look around on their plans you can see over here and you can see that the free domain is included almost in all of the plans uh, this is the primary web hosting company they have few features uh, they specifically provide hosting the horizons which is their ai turn your idea into reality they also provide you with free website migration uh, in case if you're coming from another hosting company uh, they are also being known for their easy to use control panel which they develop uh, with the name of each panel uh, this is another amazing thing about them and uh, they provide uh, they have local data centers all around in the world amazing security features are being included if we do the uh, dif uh, difference between those you can find that they got amazing security features right now they are please being used by 3 million plus people now if i look around on the uh, godaddy godaddy if if I look on the difference, GoDaddy is primarily the domain company, which eventually turned into providing on later on hosting company, but they were being known as a domain company. If you do the difference, Hostinger is a hosting company. Uh, primarily, uh, they provide free domain with majority of the plans. GoDaddy is a domain provider company, and they started selling web hosting and other services as well. That is one of the main difference between GoDaddy and Hostinger. So if you look around on their plans, website hosting plan, you can see that they provide uh, web hosting, WordPress hosting, uh, VPS hosting. You can see the difference. Uh, if you look on the Hostinger, uh, we, they provide managed web hosting, managed hosting for WooCommerce, WordPress hosting, cloud hosting, agency hosting, website builder, domain name search. They are not actually a domain provider. They are just a hosting provider. VPS hosting, they provide domain along with the hosting. They primarily do not sell domain only. GoDaddy primarily sells domains only. You can see over here, they have a specific domain. They also provide other auctions, uh, domain selling, domain broker. They have a lot of TLDs to sell on the domain like .com, .net, .org, so many. And they provide web hosting uh, uh, as an additional features. If you look around on the, all the hosting plans, if you look to the price comparison, price difference between both of them, you can see over here, that their web hosting plans start from $4.99 and their website builder plans start from $9.99. If we see the difference over here, their plan, their plan start from $2.99 and all of the plans include the website builder. If you look around and uh, if you look around the hosting the website builder, it's included in all of the plans. Now this is another difference. They sell the website builder separately Hostinger sells as a part of it. Now, another is Hostinger primary plan is $2.99 and the business plan is $3.99. If you look at the here, uh, the difference is their plan start from $4.99 and also the website builder plan at $9.99. So the price is wise, they are high as if we see the difference between Hostinger. Additionally, the managed hosting, if you look on the managed hosting, the difference is the WordPress website starts at $7.99 and the WordPress e-commerce starts at $20.99. If you look at theirs, now the WooCommerce is also the e-commerce hosting. So I'm going to show you over here that the WordPress hosting also starts from $2.99 and the WooCommerce starts at $3.99. If we do the comparison here, the WordPress managed starts at $7.99 and the Word e-commerce starts at $20.99. And here, the WooCommerce is a plugin which is being used in the WordPress hosting uh, for to make it e-commerce, uh, to sell your e-commerce website. The plan starts at $3.99. So you can see over here, if you do the comparison, you may find that hosting your plans are quite attractive price-wise. Now, if let's say we're going to explore the web hosting plans over here and do the comparison with their main plans over here. So now to figure out what's the bet better price for money wise so their basic plan you can see over here starts at 4.99 dollars comes with one website 10 gb nvme storage three panel 30 days money back guarantee 
The second plan starts at $6.99, come with one website, you can host only one website, 25 GB, C panel, free domain, free email, free SSL, 30 days money back guarantee. And their web hosting deluxe plans come with 10 websites, 50 GB storage, C panel, free domain, free email, free SSL, plus 30 days. Okay, now C panel control panel is also good. You know, this is one of the industry's oldest yet has a lot of features. So my, I, I love using the C panel. I used to love, so which is why I am going to praise GoDaddy for their panel. Every web, is, web hosting includes 99.9% uptime guarantee, unmetered bandwidth, automatic daily backup, which is very good. And you have access to global data centers. Enjoy a faster load with the data centers in North America and Europe. So, if you look around for over here, if you do the comparison over here, now look around over here with the premium plan, you can host up to 25 websites. Here you can host in the basic plan um, one website. So that's uh, that's very good. You're getting 10 GB storage over here. Here uh, you're getting 25 GB storage. Uh, in the second plan, you can host 50 websites with 50 GB storage. And in the third plan, you can host 100 websites with 100 GB NV storage. So over here, they provide you a lot over here. If you do the comparison over here with the difference, if you see the difference between them and you may find that hosting the provides more domains, more storage. Now, another thing is in the basic plan, they provide SSD storage and from uh, business plan on, onward, they provide NVMe storage. GoDaddy, on the other hand, provide NVMe storage on all of the plans. Now, this is a good thing regarding GoDaddy, but uh, if you look for them, at a $4.99 it comes. So even the second plan of Hostinger, which is at $3.99, have the NV, NV storage, have 50 GB, have 50 websites host, and you're getting free domain, free automatic website migration, free managed WordPress hosting is included. Now, if you look on them plan, you are getting managed WordPress hosting, you are getting Hostinger website builder. And now this plan is also being used for e-commerce because it has all the e-commerce features added. Now for uh, here, you may need to look for other plan to get the e-commerce plan. Now, as I told you in the comparison, if we look on the comparison over here, if I'm going to see all the hosting solutions, I'm going to see over here that the e-commerce at $20.99. So which is a much cheaper option over. Now this is the same plan, which is being shown over here as well at the $3.99. And you are also getting too much extra when you pay for 48 months combined. You are getting unlimited bandwidth, global data centers, same, 99.9% uptime guarantee, same. A uh, lot of technical details. Now, if we look around on the uh, local data centers, they also provide you local data centers all around in the world. They also have local data centers all around the world. And uh, the 30 days money back guarantee is uh, the same. 30 days money back guarantee over here. Hosting all of the uh, all plans come with the 30 days money back guarantee as well over here. And if I look around on the security features, I think that they provide DDoS attack prevention, malware scanner, web application firewall, cloud fire protected name server, secure access manager. So these are little more security features. Now I am getting these amazing security features over here in this plan in the managed WordPress hosting, where I'm getting free SSL, where I'm uh, getting site security included, which is included in all of the plans at hosting it. And uh, also my website migration tool is being provided over here. And with Hostinger, they have a dedicated website migration service. Along with a the tool, they provide you free website migration with their support. So in case of any issue, their support is going to help you with this. So you simply pick your plan, fill in the migration request forms, and they are going to submit. So with GoDaddy, you get a tool, and with Hostinger, you get a complete support. So which makes Hostinger a preferred option. And even I am using Hostinger, so you can use Hostinger as well. And the best thing is, if you buy Hostinger from my link, you and choose any plan you are going to get the uh, special uh, discount which you can uh, write over here with the have a coupon code and you can write this coupon code which you can find in the description of this video along with a special discount link so you can see that your price got a further discount and select the 48 months to uh, with two months extra free and free domain which can go up to 91 percent so that is a 91 percent the maximum amount you can get so if we do the difference over here i find that the web hosting is a better hosting company better amazing plans especially for my audience through the discount coupon code in the descri uh, description they offer you more uh, features function at lower the price 
The same plan is available at a much cheaper price at Hostinger with a lot more features specifically including security features. So my vote is with Hostinger and in case if you plan to buy your hosting from Hostinger, make sure to click on the link in the description and go with it, uh, go with it with either of the coupon code. So I hope you like this uh, comparison between Hostinger and GoDaddy where I discussed the difference, uh, difference between uh, both of the platforms and I personally found uh, Hostinger to be a better hosting provider in this difference comparison video and I highly recommend you guys to take your hosting from Hostinger with this amazing discount coupon code. So good luck with your hosting from Hostinger. Good luck.